All right, Tony Berry here. Uh, over the scanner, there's a man in the sand. Allegedly, he got uh, tased by uh, LAPD. Yeah, I guess that's the witness over here. He was somewhere on the sand as the call came in, but it I, I took me like, I was on Rose Avenue. It's about maybe a mile, two miles away from here. So I just got here. If I was raping him, and then he kept poking at me, and then he grabbed me and threw me down and started punching me in the stomach. Wow. And then he broke my fishing rod. Oh, I'm sorry. That's the point where I was scared because I thought he was gonna stick me to this thing. Yeah. He's when, really when, having some kind of a mental health episode. He was not at all together, and I tried. I I was so non-confrontational with him. I tried to be as 
as chill as I could. I was like, hey, I'm just going to my car. I'm just going, even after he hit me, even after he touched me a few times, I'm like, I'm just going to my car. I didn't front up or do anything. Because he's not right. Did he smell like booze or anything? No, actually, no, he didn't. So he was majorly having a mental health episode. Well, I'm not a professional, but it didn't seem like he was at all together. Right. But it was, still, you know, it's. But he didn't good. smell drunk or anything? I don't think so. Yeah. I don't think so, but. Terrible situation. Sorry, that happened. Yeah, it's awful. I don't okay? Even, yeah, I'm fine. I, I, he jammed my back a little, you know, tore my work shirt. It doesn't matter. Oh. But, uh, your yeah, shirt no. wasn't originally like that. No, somebody asked me, did he tear your shirt? <laughs> yeah, no. Wow. I don't go around like this. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I don't know. So, so can you please tell us what happened? What's this for? This is my, uh, we're doing the, the home, homeless uh, with the sheriffs. Um, oh, I just, this guy was having a mental health episode and he basically assaulted me and battered me. On the beach. And broke your fishing rod? Broke my fishing rod. I'm sorry that happened to you, man. What did he, he, what did he say? He said he thought you were raping him? Yeah. Wow, wow. Yeah, he was so, delusional. Yeah, no, that was pretty clear. And like I said, it wasn't, it was more upsetting than scary. Yeah, until yeah. the fishing rod broke. And I was like, well, now yeah. he does have a weapon. Sorry, sorry to hear that, man. You yeah. think you're okay? okay. Yeah, I'm okay. You've been living in Venice for a long time? No, I live in Culver City. So you've been coming here a long time. All the time. First time ever happened to you? Yes. Ugh. I generally, I mean, I, yeah, I don't, people, I don't even worry about it. You yeah. Know? I, I, I don't even, I'm like, I just keep my head down and. Yeah, that's the way you do it here, yeah. Yeah, I mean, and, and everybody leaves me alone. This yeah, was just, the police just fixated on me, wouldn't leave me, would, would not leave me alone. So sorry. Thank you, sir.